Hello there YouTube, uh, another video for me. Uh, I just wanted to show you some stuff I just got into the mail and I want to look at this guy. Uh, this is the sergeant of my Terminator um, squad. Uh, he's not done yet, he still needs a lot of stuff to do. Um, basically I base colored him, uh, I did his face, did the loincloth there. I did that with a micron pen. I know it's kind of cheating, but it's easier that way. And I started layering the sword. Uh, still need to do the highlights. Still need to do the little details, the washes. Really like how the face came out. You can't really see it on the video, but uh, it's pretty sharp like this. Uh, I think it's really nice how it turned out. Um, and I did the, the base, of course, the lava base. Uh, now I see a lot of people doing lava bases, and uh, a lot of them are way better than mine. Uh, what I basically did was Macrite Red, Gore Red, Blood Red, uh, Blazing Orange, Golden Yellow, and White in successive layers. And to get the shine, I used um, PVA, PVA glue. And it kind of protects the paint as well because it already started cracking. You can see it right there with my fingernail. There's a little crack in there. And there's some around here as well, but you can see that on the video. And I got some nice stuff in the mail today. So I want to show you guys that. What I got was the Living Saint. Celestine model, which is a really nice model. Um, there's lots of detail in there. Uh, she's holding a pigeon here, a white dove, I think. Um, fluidly are over, uh, are everywhere. Um, like on the shoulder here, there's a fluidly. Uh, she comes on a little base like that. Which is pretty cool. It saves making me up some stuff. Her cape with the uh, little chirps, angels, guys, and the tubes to connect them to the backpack. This is basically her backpack, which you won't see for the most part because it's hot, hidden behind the cape. Um, I'm gonna cut off this iron halo because the iron halo goes for my chapter master and I'll just shave it off and add that to the cape and paint the model up anyway I don't play demon hunters by the way or paint them but I think it's nice it is a really nice model so it really deserves to be painted and her sword with the arm and a bunch of roses there I mean her chicks and it comes with two bases I don't know why, maybe someone can explain, but she fits on the slotted base perfectly. Anyway, that's one. What else did I get? I got this, which is um, the uh, these guys. Space Marine, ooh, Space Marine Veteran Squad. Uh, they're pretty cool. Really like the models. Um, I'm not gonna show you their compartments, and the bases, and backpacks, and this basic stuff. What's in here? So what's basically in here? A guy with a mark. Core helmet, I believe. The Corvus helmet, anyway. He comes with a bolter. With a nice MO, ma uh, MO magazine. I really like those magazines. This look really badass. It's a really nice detailed model. It has the Corvus shoulder pad. Uh, it doesn't have the rest of the Corvus parts, but oh well. Let me cover up the curtains for light's sake. There. Really nice model. What else? 
Another guy in Corvus armor. He has Mark three legs, I think. Mark four. I don't know. Uh, he comes with a Corvus shoulder pad here. The Mark three legs again, I think. Mark four. I don't know what it is. Maybe someone can comment that. And a bolter. Um, oh, Space Marine. Really love the details on his legs. Those are pretty awesome. Details on the shoulder pads. Pretty cool. Terminus. Grux Terminus. Oh, that's a pretty good model. Again, same bolter. So this is basically their I don't know, this might be their sergeant or something. He has a power fist and a bolter and the mark six errant. Mark eight errant. I don't know what it is. That's the that's the high lid here. It looks pretty cool. I really like this armor as well. I really like this model anyway. Really dynamic pose. And I like the power fist. That's pretty cool. Now, latest model. Last last model in this box. This guy. He ha he comes with two weapon options. A combi melta and a combi plasma gun, a plasma rifle actually and the details are pretty awesome and I don't know what to pick anyway, what to put on them uh, I heard that melted guns are pretty sucky unless of course you got in, run into heavy, heavy infantry or vehicles or stuff and the plasma rifle is pretty all round good good range, stuff like that Though that fits my fluff, this might be more useful. So, anyway, leave a comment and something else I got. Put that aside. And what else? Same package. I got this. These are those guys. You might ask yourself, who are those guys? Those guys are the Mark II Space Marine veterans. So, that's in the box. I got... A guy with a bolter. And he should have a power fist. At least, that's what it says. On the website. And I found the power fist. It's right over there. And together with a messed up lightning claw. Oh well. Lightning claw belongs to. I think this guy. This guy should have the lightning claw. At least. I'm checking the website as I go, so. I believe this guy's supposed to have the lightning claw. Um, there's this guy. He has a plasma uh, plasma pistol. Really like the helmet. Shiny. They're they're really shiny. I, I these look like they're brand new or cleaned thoroughly. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna cover up the curtain a little bit more like that to get rid of the light. There, that looks much better. A little bit dark even, but it brings out the details. So. And he is getting... a uh, Power X. Which I have... Here. Power X. Pretty basic. A little more detail over here, so it's pretty nice. And what else? That's the power sword, which belongs to get rid of him. Get that of him. He gets the power sword. 
right yeah right and I really love this model this is one of my favorite of this box because it is both he's like really and of course the little combat knife here it just looks really cool this is amazing really love these veterans and of course the last guy and he's a bit of a loser of the squad he just gets a bolter like suppose though but there's not a lot of detail they covered up a bunch of stuff the entire chest area um, which saves me time painting that is true but it also hides a lot of the details I really like oh wait it's not a regular bolter it has like extra lens there so I don't know if anyone is playing the uh, Space Marine video game uh, clip it up it's a stalker bolter maybe whatever but yeah no power weapons for you sir and that's about it I didn't get around working some more on my uh, on my uh, Captain Master I'm using sticks right here put them on maybe paint some uh, spray some white on it see if I missed anything because it shows really nice if you spray it with white uh, spray paint uh, start painting up uh, just this little uh, shoulder pad believe this one belongs to the blood angel sanguinar guard or something uh, what I did is I sprayed it white as you can see in the inside um, gave the uh, the entire thing a blue wash and the stage I'm at now well, I did some silver in the middle and some black there I mean that's not and this is uh, astronomical grey and it's not as light as I would have hoped so I might go over it with Codex Grey. You see blue still in the recesses, that's the wash. Um, so I go over it with Codex Grey, give another highlight, and then with pure skull white to finish off the highlight. And I shaved off the um, the, the emblem that was on there. I don't know what was that. It might have been a, a chalice or a skull. I think it was a chalice or something, or a drop of blood. I shaved it off because. It's a no-go in my army. Uh, for people that want to paint the Sanguinar Guard dudes with the shoulder pads, yeah, spray it white because it's way easier way to do it. Cover it up with a blue wash and do successive highlights with shades of grey going to pure white. Anything else? No, I think that's about it. Um, again, if you guys have suggestions for the hammer I can use on my uh, chapter master, I would really appreciate that. So, come on with some suggestions. I'll start working on the, all these guys. And I'll get back at you. See ya. Thank you for watching.